Once this sounded like a myth, a story from an ancient epic or the fantasy of medieval alchemists, eternal youth, a state in which the human body does not deteriorate, the skin remains smooth, the organs function like those of a 20-year-old, and the brain is like that of a child, full of vitality and curiosity. It was a dream pursued across ages by Egyptian priests, Chinese emperors, Spanish conquistadors, and millions of scientists, from mystics to Nobel laureates. But now, for the first time in human history, we are nearing the threshold of what was once considered impossible, a game with time, a victory over aging, and it is all thanks to an extraordinary alliance between Japanese science and the American tech giant NVIDIA. In the year 2022, an ambitious project called Project Regenesis was launched in Kyoto. It remained classified from the public for almost two years. It was funded by multiple entities, from Japanese governmental institutions to private foundations such as Riken and the Kyoto University Biocomputing Center. But most importantly, a company NVIDIA, whose name has become synonymous with artificial intelligence, joined the initiative. It all began with a simple question. What if aging is not a random event, but a mistake that can be corrected? Scientists turned to billions of biological data points, genomes, proteomes, histological slices, medical images, and the results of hundreds of thousands of blood, DNA, and RNA analyses. Instead of processing them manually, they built an AI system capable of detecting patterns never before visible to humans. This system was codenamed Amaterasu, after the Japanese sun goddess who brings light and life. Amaterasu is not just a neural network, it is a quantum-inspired hybrid system, launched on an array of NVIDIA GPUs using the Blackwell B200 architecture, enhanced by experimental photonic chips developed in Japan. This allowed it to analyze not only textual and numerical data, but also molecular interactions in real time. It literally observed how cells age, how their membranes change, which proteins accumulate with time, how mitochondria degrade, and most importantly, why. Within the first six months, Amaterasu processed more than 128 million individual medical profiles, from Japanese centenarians living in Okinawa to patients with rare genetic anomalies in clinics across Europe and the United States. It searched for patterns, and in the year 2023, for the first time in the history of bioinformatics, it identified a sequence later called the Y-loop, a closed cycle of interactions between the proteins FOXO3, CLOTHO, and NAD. As shown by the AI, this cycle could be restarted. It was a revolution. In essence, Amaterasu discovered that aging is not a linear process, as previously thought, but a loop triggered under certain conditions. Stress, nutrition, genes, and environment, all of these factors influence the activation of the cycle. But if those parameters are altered, the loop can be reset. In other words, the body can remember what it was like at 25 and begin to behave accordingly. This is not just life extension, this is biological rejuvenation. Then came the experiments, first on cells, then on tissues, then on animals, and at every stage, the findings were confirmed time could be reversed. The skin of mice treated with a molecular complex developed under AI supervision became 40% denser. Hair began to grow again. The heart started functioning like that of a young specimen. But the most astonishing change occurred in the brain. After administration of the so-called RE-Y formula, specially adapted for each organism, the AI recorded a restoration of neural activity to levels previously observed only in juveniles. Memory reaction speed, even emotional responses. Everything began to change. Time moved backward. By the year 2024, the first closed human trials began. The participants were volunteers, elderly individuals aged 70 to 80 years, free from severe illnesses. 60 days after receiving the formula and following a diet selected by the AI, their skin began to change its structure. New collagen fibers appeared, age spots disappeared, vascular elasticity improved by 28%, but most importantly, 7 out of 10 participants demonstrated actual rejuvenation at the cellular level. Their biological age, measured using Horvath's epigenetic clocks, decreased by 15 to 20 years. This was not an illusion, 
it was confirmed in the laboratory, the world began to understand. We are standing at the threshold of a new era. What makes this project truly unique is the symbiosis between humans and artificial intelligence. Amaterasu does not merely collect data, it learns from every organism. Each new trial participant teaches the AI how to better select formulas. Every cell becomes part of the algorithm. This is not medicine. This is an artificial biological mind created to conquer aging. Currently, the Amaterasu system operates in six bio-institutes across Japan. It is already connected to DNA cryo-storage facilities, hundreds of biobanks, medical data registries, and satellite environmental monitoring systems. Its mission over the next two years is to create a fully personalized rejuvenation formula for every individual. And it will not be just a cream or a pill. It will be a system from nutrition to sleep, from gut microbiome to hormonal balance. Everything will be calculated by AI, individually, with millimeter level precision. One of the project's most extraordinary goals is to stop apoptosis, the natural self-destruct program of cells. Amaterasu discovered that with precise modulation of the genes P53 and CERT1, it is possible not only to slow down apoptosis, but also to trigger a process in which old cells do not die, but return to an active state. This means degenerative diseases like Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, and even certain cancers could potentially be avoided. Moreover, telomere shortening, long considered the main cause of aging, can be significantly slowed. This is no longer science fiction. It is the first version of eternal youth. But as always, the question arises, what comes next? How will the world respond if humans can live 120 to 150 years in the body of a 30-year-old? How will the economy change? Psychology? Politics? These questions are already being discussed in private laboratories. Some corporations are rumored to be ready to invest tens of billions of dollars to secure exclusive access to Amaterasu. NVIDIA has already registered patents for a new generation of chips designed for real-time biointerpretation, aimed at integrating AI molecular analysis systems into clinics and private homes. This means that in the future, everyone may have their own personal AI doctor monitoring aging in real time. And this is only the beginning. Scientists in Japan are already discussing the next phase, neurogenetic self-repair. When the body itself rolls back to a younger state, autonomously restarting youth processes without external intervention, this could mean the complete disappearance of the concept of old age as we know it. And at that point, we will have truly crossed the point of no return. The world is on the brink of a new era, an era in which aging will no longer be the norm, where AI will not just be an assistant, but a guide to a new biological reality where 90 years will no longer be the end, but the middle of the journey. And all of this has become possible thanks to the relentless determination of Japanese scientists and the power of NVIDIA's artificial intelligence. This is not merely a scientific breakthrough. This is a reboot of human history.